Hey okay, guys, it is 22 minutes after 3 and I've been out here since 8 o'clock getting these panels ready for the carbon fiber lock. As you can see, I took the time to put them in black base. Uh, this is just a test. I never did this before. Uh, I don't know if it's going to work out or not. Um, but I'm going to give it a hook. If it don't, I'll just sand them down and paint them the color of the car is going to the color of the car is going to be so like I said this is just an experiment so never did this before I did a couple test panels this you know you can see that or not but I don't know if it's going to turn out or not uh, already our mat's not long enough all I could get was four foot lengths. I have two lengths. So Sherry and I is going to lay it on the hood there. I'm not sure which way to go with it yet, but I'm thinking two strips up this way, that way, and go from there. So I'm just going to set the camera. I've got my silver all, I got the gun all filled up with my silver, which is, I don't know if you can see that, but it's in there. Uh, that's the color. Just, uh, Galaxy silver, I guess it is So we're gonna set the camera right here somewhere and I don't know which part to do first Actually, I'm gonna go for the hood first Because those other panels got a lot of curves in them. I don't know how they're gonna turn out. So we'll get you set up here and See if, see if I can get that hood in there Ooh. Focused in. Now, I'm gonna grab the up curves gloves. I got these tapped off already. So that's one thing done. I got my filters in, floor's wet, so I'm trying to cut down on the dirt. Here's me first mat. Give you a shot here in a minute. I gotta roll it up under the hood. Actually, if uh, you want to grab the camera sure you might be able to show it as I go. I'm worried about these curves in the hood. So, like I said, it may or may not work out. I'm gonna try using two straps at the same time. See if it works. About, whoops, that's not straight. To bear with me, it's going to be a slow process. And i got to make sure I don't go that way too far when I spray. That looks pretty straight. So I'm going to try to line these two pieces up. This piece I already tried it used. I wish I had a male I'll find a bigger piece of mat. I don't even know if I should be doing it this way, but I'm going to try. I have a funny feeling that should overlap that. Do this a little wee tiny bit. So those little. So I don't get little holes mixed in with the big holes. It is now. Mm hmm? It is now. It's what? It was like a minute ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. I'm going to put my mask on and give that a shot. All we can do is screw it up. I'm going to try to beat the edge. Let me get on with me.
species. So what's up here?
shut you off here and I gotta figure out what kind of color I'm gonna use to shade it in with and I'll turn the camera back on then. So we'll be back. Man. Okay guys, I, I went with an over and reduced black, so I had toned it down. Uh, it don't look too bad, but I got lines for the padding overlap, so I'm gonna try to fix it.
the hell I was trying to do. There's lines, and I was trying to hide them. I don't think I'm going to be able to achieve it though. So, I'm going to let that flash off and clear it. See what it looks like. That's all I can do. We'll go from there. Uh, trying to keep them all the same color, shade, whatever. It doesn't look too bad, but we'll see. See what she looks like when she's uh, cleared. So I'll be back, guys. five to six and I finished clearing these about I don't know 15 20 minutes ago uh, these parts were a success they look pretty good they actually come out really good a little bit of trash but it looks like a really good deep finish there's three three coats of clear on here <clears throat> and I'll show you this part it turned out really good nice and shiny T get right there you gotta run I don't know if you can see that or not there's a little run there, right there. It's not, it's not really a run. It's a really heavy build up to clear. But these these two pieces turned out good. The hood now, different story. I got lines. One faint line there. You can see it and quite a dominant line up there so I cleared it anyways uh, it was fun trying it I am going to wet sand and buff it see how it looks see if I can get a shot of the finishes on this thing it looks really good that way it's just the color is blotchy uh, light there dark light spots dark spots the hood was hard to do I thought it was going to be the easiest but it turned out those parts were the easiest so there you go experiment not quite right um, my cap on my gun There's a little hole right there, and I had it. I was keeping track of it, and make sure it was pointing towards me, but I missed, and it was pointing towards the needle in the air cap, and it dripped. I'll show you where it dripped. It's just a cheap cap I picked up at an auto supply here, where it dripped right there which I think it might sand out, I'm not sure. It'll give me some practice with the wet sanding. 
and along that edge and somewhere else oh yeah right here before I noticed it uh, I don't know if you can see that or not but there's some drips right there that's where it came from off the end of the gap so uh, like I said my first try at this I am gonna wet sand and buff it see how it looks and then I'll put the hood away and maybe by then I'll have a bigger piece of mat see if I can get a piece of mat that'll cover that whole hood and I'll do it again I'll try it again so I like these parts you can say they look they look pretty good they even have a little bit of light and dark but not enough to not enough to throw it off that bad like where it's light is under the bumper or right in close to the car so not too worried about that and the other piece is pretty good test panel looks pretty good actually it turned out better than the rest of them it's just as flat as a pancake and believe it or not it's right close to the floor and I don't think I got as much dirt in it for some reason anyways guys <coughs> this video is long enough it's getting late and I got one heck of a mess to clean up look like a mad scientist over here I tried putting some of the paint from yesterday on it that didn't even show up at all so I ended up over reducing the black and trying to tone it down but I just couldn't get it so that's what we got experiment one on the carbon fiber but I'm going to try it again at least the hood is got good coating on it and this hood is straight uh, I wish I can show you but there's not a ding dent that I can see in this hood really it's just it's really good shape I'm happy with uh, the condition of it you really can't get a shot of that all the lines are good on the top front done it like there was a little bit of body work on the front here and it's, I can't see it I figured if anything would show up it would show up in this color but it didn't so I was lucky there just those lines lines freak me up so but next time uh, I might have had my air pressure too high too because I did notice it was kind of flipping the mat up a little bit so maybe next time I'll turn the air pressure down or something so anyways it's been a long day for an experiment but I'm glad I did it uh, it's not a curiosity anymore um, I am going to try it again because I like the low I really do but I just need some bigger mat that mat wasn't wasn't big enough so and uh, I did lock that gun down I never changed the the fluid to, or the fluid control on that since yesterday I just left it where it was and it's working good I just got to remember to make sure that cap is turned the right way or get a different type if I can find one I'm not sure but I like that gun it sprays good it lays it out good and uh, oh yeah Milo asked me if I could get reducer for that clear well what I done I mixed up a little bit and I put some of this reducer in it the PPG uh, medium reducer and it didn't do nothing so I reduced it a little bit and it seemed to flow out even better than it did yesterday so uh, I was just experimenting all the way around so anyways guys uh, hope that wasn't too too boring and uh, thanks for watching all the comments and we won't see you again until next Friday um, but I am gonna wet sand and buff these or yeah wet sand and buff them see how they look anyways and uh, put them away for now and get on something constructive enough play time so we will see you next Friday so have a good one and thanks for watching take care talk to you later